Hello, this is the National Weather Service Jackson Severe Weather Briefing. This is recorded on Monday, March 25th, 2024. A strong storm system will move across the region tonight, Monday night, March 25th. And we're looking at multiple uh, hazards that are possible with this system, including severe storms and tornadoes, a localized flooding threat, and also some really strong winds outside of the thunderstorms. Our biggest concern is going to be with the severe weather threat from Monday afternoon into Monday night. Uh, much of the area has been highlighted with an enhanced risk for severe weather, uh, level 3 out of 5. And our primary concerns with that are going to be damaging wind gusts up to 70 miles per hour and tornadoes. Some of those tornadoes uh, could be strong as well. Uh, there is also potential for some hail up to quarter size, but that is more of a secondary threat. Um, most of these storms will occur along a line or a broken line of storms that will begin to approach the uh, northeast portions of Louisiana, southeast Arkansas, and the Mississippi River area uh, late Monday afternoon into the early part of Monday evening, and then progressing further eastward across the state of Mississippi into Monday night and uh, the very early portion of the overnight hours into early Tuesday morning. Along with that severe weather threat, uh, localized flooding is possible. Uh, most areas will receive one to three inches of rain, but some localized areas could see higher totals, up to around five to six inches of rain, which could result in flash flooding. And some minor river flooding may also result from that rainfall. And that heaviest rain uh, will coincide with the storm threat from the late afternoon hours into the Monday night hours. Here's a look of at uh, expected rainfall totals uh, with the system. This will primarily occur from late Monday afternoon into Monday night with drier weather conditions beyond that into Tuesday. Again, most areas will see on average one to three inches of rain, but some locally higher amounts are possible. And then our final uh, hazard concern uh, with this storm system is going to be the potential for strong non-thunderstorm winds and these will be ongoing as early as the daytime today, Monday, uh, and continuing into tonight, Monday night, until that line of storms moves through. Uh, with those winds, we could see gusts in the 40 to 50 mile per hour range in some areas, which will be enough to down some trees and some large tree limbs and may result in some scattered power outages. Uh, may also cause some difficulty with driving. Uh, this is a look at the probability for wind gusts over 40 miles per hour. Um, and uh, as, as can be seen, there are very uh, high probabilities for that across most of our area. And looking at the probability of 55 mile per hour wind gusts, probabilities are low, but there are some uh, possibilities for even wind gusts in uh, that uh, range up to 55 miles per hour. And again, this is outside of thunderstorms. Within the severe thunderstorms, there could be gusts up to 70 miles per hour. That concludes our weather briefing update for this Monday, March 25th. If you have any questions, uh, please feel free to reach out to us by calling us or by reaching out to us on social media. Thanks for viewing.